Nice drive, finish off the rim. Carter final seconds. Nice pass to get the assist. Four point game. Here is Carter. Carter will heave and hit at the buzzer. But Seattle holds on thanks to their incredible free throw shooting down the stretch. 93 92 the final. Uh, that hit Savoli or right in the foot. Not Savoli, excuse me. Oh, Elizabeth Williams with the emphatic block. She thought it was a good block. You gotta try to deny her the ball. Now on the other side, when she can score, that's bonus points for Connecticut. When she finds her open teammate, Shakina Strickland knocks down the three. About 18 for the game, 17. 18 of 30, they shoot 60% from beyond the arc, 57% from the floor overall. Courtney Williams hands it over to Laney. Laney with a nice pass. How did she get that over to Williams? Two can work together with this team. Makes them very dangerous. Like Dietrich with the shot clock winding down. So you go with Glory, who's had the hot hand. She's taking it, dishing it out to Bernard. Laney has the buzzer. Yes, ma'am. See, here's a couple of exchanges. Courtney Williams going right. Guarded by the toddler, Candace Parker, but oh my, Bunny Williams. I think the, the greatest thing about that was the unity, the allow unity and being able to speak. That's one of those cobweb plays here. They got plenty of time. Laney. Hoists it up and banks it in at the buzzer. We're going to count it in after 10. We're just over a minute to go. Lake Dietrich puts it up and gets it to fall. Carter inbounds it. Shot on the way. Laney rips the three. And that's the way the first quarter will come to an end. With Carter. Laney into the lane. Oh, come on. You can't be serious, Banaja Laney. <laughs> now the Washington Mystics won the first meeting between these two teams. But remember, Kennedy Carter didn't play in that game. That is the huge difference. Out the basket and a foul.